Hey everyone, welcome back to the Nerdy Collector and today I'm going to be reviewing this Black Panther Eric Killmonger Limited Edition Chase Pop. Now I picked this up not so long ago at HMV in Oxford Street, London and I have been dying to do a review of it and get it out of the box and have a look because it looks a fantastic pop. Unfortunately I don't have the common to compare but I have picked up this Chase. As we can see on the front here we've got Black Panther 278, we've got Pop up in the top corner there, Eric Killmonger, a nice picture of the common pop that we have there, the Limited Edition Chase sticker which we all love if you are a pop collector. On the side there we've got a nice picture of Killmonger himself and on the back you've got the others available in the wave. I am still crying out for that Killmonger go in the dark. And on the back here you've got the rest of the set available in the wave. I have got the Black Panther Chase as well also for this series so if you'd like me to do a review let me know in the comments. I've got Eric Killmonger on the side, Eric on the top. Let's waste no time. I'm going to be very careful because I do want to display this one in box and take Eric Killmonger out of the box and let's have a look at him for the first time. Ooh. And here's Killmonger out of his package. Right now, first things first, guys. This pop looks amazing. Honest to God, the head sculpt on this is fantastic. I mean, it's a bobblehead, obviously, as it's a Marvel uh, Funko. But if you've seen the Black Panther film, you'll know that he steals this from the British Museum and he wears it when he's doing um, some of his jobs. Now, this is a fantastic head sculpt. I really love the horns on this. The detail on that is brilliant. I mean, the detail throughout is fantastic. This this is what I like about a chase. It's not just something that's a minor change. It's an absolutely humongous change. And on the back here, I haven't seen that as well. Look, you've got all that detail in there, all that fur coming up, and then you've got the, the head strap as well, which is really cool. And on the back of him there, you can see his combat boots and on the back of him he's got a nice utility belt there with all his stuff hanging on that nice blue throughout his uh, his jacket arms and stuff there they've done a really nice job on this pop if I turn it more to the side there you can see he's got a spear in this hand which is really nicely detailed all lumpy and bumpy throughout I'll bring that up to the camera he's got a really nice uh, looking spear there and on this side he's got like a big sword like machete which is looking really cool and even down to the bottom of the and even gold plated the handle which is really nice I really like the look of this pop I think it's amazing like I said I will keep this in box because it is a chase but I really like it the texture of the horns is amazing let's just take a closer look at that face sculpt the, the whole mask is brilliant the way they put the eyes in that gap I really like it I really think that this pop exceeds like a good quality for a chase I paid what 14 99 for this chase and it was very well worth it I think it's a fantastic figure and I really do think that it is better than the common. Like lots of some chases, the common is actually better than the chase, and some they just like not like the Duck Dodgers chase I've got in the background there. It's just not really much difference between the normal pop, and neither is that Sub Zero to be honest uh, in the background there. I've got the whole hog, and I really like it. So guys, let me know what you think of this Killmonger chase, and if you have it in your collection. And if you do, you're very lucky because it is a fantastic pop to have. Smash that subscribe button, guys. Do me a favour and subscribe to this channel. Hit the notification bell. Like this video. Drop me a comment below. Let me know what you think, like I said. Uh, follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and my new Facebook page. Links in the description below. And um, guys, check out my other reviews. Check out my toy hunts and all my other videos on this channel. Thanks for your support, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.